basically, since I bought the keyboard, I have not been able to make this room work. Actually, it's the keyboard and the chair. The chair has been a major blessing and curse. I love the chair, but the chair takes up a lot of space. Or maybe it's the ottoman that takes up the space. One of them is taking up a lot of space. So today, I am going to do something unexpected, but I was hit with inspiration last night and realized that I have more wood in the garage than I thought I did. And this is what I'm gonna do. First thing is, I'm gonna take this out of here, I'm gonna tear it up, and I'm gonna actually turn it into the piano, keyboard, musical, all-encompassing thing storage area. That's right, I'm basically gonna turn it into a giant keyboard stand that's fitted for the microphone, the interface, the computer, speakers, bass amp, all of that's gonna go into that. I know it's probably hard to see right now, but it's in here. So you might be saying, what are you gonna do about all of your books? Well, to be honest with you, here's the thing about the books. The books being in my office don't really make a major impact. Um, I'll put my Bibles somewhere yet to be determined, the ones that I'm in on a regular basis, but I can put the books in the other book area. We have other books in the house. I can put them out there. To be honest with you, the books I have in here primarily have been for decoration for the show. But that's not all I'm tearing up today. The other thing we're gonna tear up is this doodad right here. Now, this area is gonna be a mess after I do this because this uh, is all storage stuff. But what I found is this is actually really inefficient for me and it's not working. So I think I'm gonna go get a tool chest from uh, Lowe's or Home Depot, put that in here, put all of my gear storage in that and that way everything is kind of shelfified so I can just pull things out. Uh, this does cover the unsightliness of this uh, wood not going all the way to the floor. So we'll deal with that uh, in the meantime as well. But until then, but my friends, until then, this is gonna be ugly. I'm actually gonna turn this into, I'm gonna put it on its side. I'm gonna turn this into like a narrow bookshelf. So some of the books may stay, that'll probably be where my Bibles go. But more importantly than the books, it's the Green Ranger stuff that we gotta put on there. Green Ranger, greater than books. Also, I'll be using the casters from this to, are those the same size? I might have to make some adjustments, but I'll be using the casters from this to offset what's going on with the front end that I have to add to the piano storage bench area. But basically what has to happen is these things have to get torn up first. And so that's about to happen.
bring that thing in here. Gotta move some things around. I'm gonna bring it in, load it up, set it up. Boom, boom, boom. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom, bada bing. where I started getting nervous, right there. All right, so the hope is that this thing's relatively easy to put together. I think it's mostly put together. I'm hoping it's already on the casters. That's the big deal, so. I'm gonna look in here and it's gonna tell me what has not been assembled. This way I can prepare myself if I need to put wheels on it because putting wheels on this thing is 250 pounds. By the way, don't know if I told you the story. I went to pick it up at the store, but it's 250 pounds, so I didn't. Yeah, it looks like it only wants me to put on the handlebar, which is great. I'm not seeing casters. I gotta figure out a way to get the casters on there. Shoot. <laughs> 